Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Jenny. Happy Thursday to you. Today I'm going to be taking you to my favorite Dollar Tree. This one is located on Maysville Road here in Fort Wayne, Indiana. It is over 13,000 square feet. And yes, I did find some new amazing items and I'm excited for you to see. But before I take you to the Dollar Tree, I just wanted to let you guys know I'm planning on doing this line of videos, which today this video is going up. Tomorrow is going to be a Dollar Tree haul. Saturday is going to be a Dollar Tree DIY. Sunday is going to be a Dollar Tree haul. Monday is going to be a Hobby Lobby haul. Possibly Tuesday will be another DIY. Wednesday probably be another Hobby Lobby haul. And Thursday might be a walkthrough, not 100% sure, or maybe another DIY because I have been working on many DIYs. If you have any suggestions on what other videos you would like me to see, be sure you comment down below. So let's go ahead and head to the Dollar Tree. So here we have a pack of 25 cosmetic sponges by Spa Savvy. This is an amazing deal, you guys, for only a dollar. Wow. Here we have some April Spa Bath and Shower. This is Cucumber and Pink Grapefruit Clay Masks, an exfoli exfoliating scrub. Here we have some name brand Bayer for cough and cold, high blood pressure. Here's some Spa Naturals Activated Charcoal Bath Soak with Pure Epsom Salt. This is a one pound bag, and they also had this moisturizing avocado oil for calming and relaxing soak. We all could use this, right? Look at this, LA Colors Festival Collection. This is LA Colors Tattoo Stamp. What? So they have a star, a moon, a heart, and a flower. And down here, you have some eyeshadow pencils in different colors, liquid liner, some mascara, liquid shimmer, and prism gel. Here's a new glass, find final fling before the ring. Look at all of these long sleeve shirts. Wow, for only a dollar? They had tank tops, polo shirts, t-shirts, all well organized by size and length. I found a new wall sticker by Main Street. Some sunflowers with some bees. And I do believe that's the only new one I noticed. Here's some Crafter Square aprons, 20 inch stain resistant they had it in yellow green blue and red look at this hellman's real mayonnaise made with cage-free eggs four ounce squeeze thingy wow they really stocked their glassware holy cow Look at all of this. Here's some lab putty. This was up by the register. They have three different ones. This one is color changing. This one is sculpting glass, ages four and up. And this one is big bounce. Purple, orange, and blue. Here's some new playing cards, ages 21 and up. Sips and Secrets. And then Guilty Party. Two plus players. Fuzzy pins. Here's like a gold metallic table cover. 54 inches and they also had this one that I showed you earlier in the week. Look at all of this wired edge ribbon for a wedding or for whatever. These are new inflatable decor. This is a 23.5 ounce dinosaur. 
You have a unicorn that is 20 inches, and then you have a diamond ring that is 22 inches. They have the dowel furniture back in stock. They did have a couple of new books. Now I limited on how many items I did touch. And I did not lay anything out to take pictures or anything. So just want to throw that out there. Other than that, I don't believe there's anything else new over here in Bookland. So, of course, the Crafter Square, they have that all stocked, ready to go. And over here, they have a bunch of activity books, crossword puzzles. Perfect items for staying at home, driving in the car, Easter baskets. They have some new yarn. They have it in orange, green, yellow, white, blue, red, and purple. Very bright colors. Love it. Here's some new candle holders. These are glass. So you have blue, clear, black, green, orange, and red. Also, they have these. They have them in silver, gold, and rose gold. Sparkly inside. They have these back in stock. They usually have these around 4th of July. These are mason jars with handles. They have it in red, blue, and clear. They have these back in stock. These are letter boards. They have it in gray and black. I'm going to step back here and kind of scan over everything. They have a lot of pictures and they also have all the brand new canvas in stock along with the wooden pictures down there. So yes, they put a bunch out. Look at all those. They have these back in stock as well. That is what you put the incense on. They have it in rose and jasmine incense stick. Yeah. They have some new floral garden ribbon, six yards, pink, purple, yellow, red, pink, blue, yellow, silver. And then they have these brighter colors, red, green, yellow, dark green, purple, pink, orange, blue, and black. Lots and lots of ribbon. And they also have this um, pearl wrap back in stock. This sold out super fast. So yeah, a lot of goodies over here. I had to pick up a few more things for my DIY I've been working on. Some of the wall sticker things. Oh my gosh, they have these in the ginormous baskets. Wow. They have it in the orange, or the pink and gray. And they completely stock this back up. Last week, they sold out of a bunch of these. So, if you need to organize things, here you go. Here's a hand and nail glove set. Nourishing, softening, uplifting. Oh, some more new hard candy makeup, that is. So a bronzer and blush. They have some new bows. The smaller ones, you get a pack of two. And then the bigger ones, you get one. And these were up by the register on this little rack thing. And then over here, they have some more new bows those are pretty they had them in different colors 
Okay, well, that's the end of our Dollar Tree trip. I sure hope you enjoyed it and you're able to find some goodies to jot down onto your wish list. If you want, why don't you go ahead and comment down below and let me know if you've seen something in hopes that you can find at one of your local Dollar Trees. If you want to keep up to date on what is new at the Dollar Tree along with other stores, then go ahead and click on that subscribe button. If you want to be notified as soon as I upload a video, then be sure you click on to that little bell. You can also follow me on Instagram, which I will link down below. I try to post pictures almost every day. I have pictures on my dogs and my family and sometimes DIYs. As I stated at the beginning of the video, I would love to hear your guys' suggestions on what kind of videos you would like for me to do, since I will be limiting my time outside the home. As always, I want to say thank you to all of you for always taking the time out of your day to sit down and watch my videos. I really do appreciate it. I will also be adding extra footage of my dogs at the end of my videos just to bring in that extra smile to your face. So I hope you all have a wonderful, beautiful, safe Thursday, and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. Keep smiling.